Uh, is this a closet or just another hallway? What in the... Welcome back to the place, no ma, everyone. So we got two kind of objectives circling around us right now. One is picking up that dead body we found that I just kind of left laying there. I'm going to see if we can do that. Um, if we just need three people in our party. So I'm going to... Let's see. Let's bring... I guess let's bring Morgan because we'll get some money. And then let's bring Alec the detective because he's big and strong. So there we go. Going to need some muscle to move the body. So I'm just going to try that and see if that works. The other thing is we need to go into the door behind the bookcase, which we will do right after this. I'm sure there's some good stuff down there and we probably will not maybe get eaten by monsters. I don't know. I don't know. It seems bad. So anyways, I got to remember where the hell this was. This was on the door to the left here. Oh, okay, of course. All right, they snuck up on me while I was looking at the map. Okay, all right. So, right in here. Right? Okay, good. This body didn't disappear. Nothing dragged it off. All right, I see the course of an explorer before me from its neck and expanded with the initials of LM. Scribe upon it. Yeah, can I... Wait, I still can't pick this up. Do I... Do I need to buy, like, a body bag? Or something? Is there a special button here? That I should press? I'm not sure. What are all the buttons on the SNES controller? Oh, they had L and R. That was pretty that was pretty novel at the time. Alright, uh Okay, so oh, I just realized there's a message speed option. <laughs> I've never hit start. <laughs> okay. Let's let's do that. Wait. There we go. And yeah, stereo, it's probably been on stereo the whole time. Uh, okay, let me try and figure this out. You're the ones exploring the haunted hall and are somehow still alive, right? I'm looking for someone who went in but never came out. His name is Lewis Martin. God damn it. Okay. So we do need a quest to be activated before we can pick him up. I'm assuming. So his initials are LM on the on the pendant or whatever. We look for him. Yeah, he he's he's dead. I can already tell you. I don't have much money, but I can also offer this camera. Okay. I already have a camera, but... I mean... I guess it's fine. I can probably sell it or something. Um, what is it? 1924? Camera's probably worth a decent amount of money. So... With that said now... So I have that quest activated. So can I bring all my people with then? I don't know how they let me walk all that way without having an encounter, but I really appreciate it. Okay. LM described upon it. Uh, probably that of Martin. The man the town hired me to investigate. Should we drag his corpse back to town? Yes. And so I ensured his family that his corpse was laid to proper rest. Do oh, it just takes us right out? Alright, well, that's pretty convenient. Martin is dead? No. One last thing to do, then. He needs a proper burial. Deserves that much. Can you take his body to the cemetery? I, I guess. Appreciate you bringing Martin back. Here are the items I promised you. Did we actually bring his body into the bar earlier? Or... I hope not. Alright, here are the items I promised you. 100 bucks and brownie camera. Oh. Maybe that's better than the default camera. I realized 500 XP. Holy. That's pretty good. That's, uh, what? 125 a piece? That's pretty good. So, uh, let's... Equip Morgan, I'm assuming box camera. Uh, act in battle. I'm assuming the brownie camera is better. Just by virtue of the box camera being the default one. I guess we'll see once we start bringing photos back. How's the investigation going? By the way, do you see the old fortune teller? Yes, I did. Jeez, does your... No, your conversation doesn't change. Okay, all right. Well, I'm glad we solved one mystery here. We can go on then. Let's go see what's behind the bookcase. Wow, oh, all right. Damn, they surprised us. Yeah, they sure did. We took one step in here and we're just getting jumped. Wow, okay, that message speed is really fast. That, that was crazy. So we took five damage. Um, I just barely saw that. Maybe I'll switch that back to two. I mean, I do like it being faster, but, like, I, I can't read this. This is, <laughs> I mean, this is really good, though, if, um, 
I don't know, if you're stuck grinding for like 10 hours or something. That's that's probably what this mode is meant for. I really appreciate that. Okay, alright, we got one of them out. Alright, there we go, no problem. 20 XP, 10? Really? 10 E? That's hardly anything. They seem tougher than a lot of the other, um... Not the other enemies. Okay, alright. There we go. I wanna, I wanna be able to read what's going on. So, I, if I'm not mistaking, that was the butler's room, right? Gosh, I gotta stop. Oh, he's the iron key. Wait, didn't we go in here? Benedict's study. Yeah, yeah, it was a story here. I don't know, we must have locked on our way out. We're actually pretty polite house guests. I'm proud of you guys. Leaving it the way you found it. Yeah, I'm... I'm a little bit scared of the basement down here. Uh, is this a closet or just another hallway? What in the fuck? <laughs> okay, this just got... Like, upstairs it was like regular, like, spooky enemies you'd expect. And then the first one I run into is this. I don't know, should we talk to it? I, I don't know, I doubt it. it. Are we gonna be able to fight this? This looks really bad. Shoot your beam, shoot the gun. Please get a good photograph of this. Okay, attacked it. Yep, how much damage are we talking about here? 14, that's pretty good. All right, keep keep it up, you guys. Seriously, we need that. Seven, okay, that's, that's all right. It's still alive, though. Give it a good cut. 10 points. It's not dead. Uh, land crawler. Bobberson took six. Why is Bobbers? Excuse me. Why is Bobbers the only one getting hit here? He has seven health. He could actually die. I'd prefer for that not to happen. I don't know. Let's restore injury. I actually put him second in line on purpose, so then he t takes less hits. But oh, he dodged right. Is that what I just saw? I need to stop blabbing. Okay, eight. How much? This guy is taking a lot of heat. Seven. Does he have like 50 health or something? Take that photograph. All right. Oh yeah, that's right. Lamont's healing. Well, eight points. That's actually pretty good. That's pretty good for him. All right, everyone. No, sorry. Don't do that attack. All right. So the enemies are getting significantly tougher down here. I mean. I guess I was right to uh, be be cautious. All right, stranger beam. Six points, and it dodged. Oh my god! How? This thing's insane. I don't even know what it is. Is it a worm with a bunch of worms in its mouth? Like, is that its head? Like, it has divots where eyes should be, maybe? I. I, I don't know what this is. Why is it not dead? Is this a boss? All right. My gosh, please. Can someone cut it up? Oh my. This is insane. All right, come on. Oh, Alec has his ability. Shit. Except I think that attacks multiple people, so I don't know if it's so good against one person. Oh my gosh, thank you. We survived, yeah. 400 XP? Was that a boss? Not gonna lie, it's some serious XP, so I kinda wanna hang out down here. Shelves lining this musty room are completely covered in spider webs. What manner of tomes and antiquities are here? I don't know, antiquities? That that sounds like money. That sounds like some good money. Ooh, oh, and dolls. Those are some creepy dolls. Alright. Alec, if you could have carried over your max, your overdrive, your whatever the hell you want to call it, that would have been awesome. So I think the knives are in the front row, so I guess we'll go for those first. But you can still photograph the dolls. The doll smiled. Oh, he's confused? Are you, are you confused why a doll is smiling at you? Maybe it likes you. I don't know. Come on, bobbers. It's all right. Aim for the body. Damn, another one just punched me. Okay, all right. So they all just get to go first. That's... Oh my... Okay, all right. It's okay. We're still alive. 
good job. Cut the cut the knife. That's that's how we take care of this. Bobbers took six points of damage. She, wow. Bobbers felt better. All right, at least he recovered. Good God, man was so confused. Point of the damn whatever energy beam at himself. Why is everyone attacking Bobbers? What? He's got two health. I mean, I guess a couple other people took damage, but seriously, you guys need to calm down. God. Okay, alright, please. Take these things out. Alright, photograph? Alright, fine. This is not good. Um... Store injury. Please don't hit bobbers. You son of a... <laughs> It didn't help he didn't dodge anything either. Ah, shit. Alright, well, that's $300 down the drain. Is how I look at this. I don't really care about the loss of life here. I'm more concerned about the loss of my wallet. Okay, alright. And then Lamont just healed himself instead. I mean, that's fine. Whatever. Now Alec needs some health. So are they actually going to attack someone else? You know, for all I know, they're going to keep attacking Bobber's dead body with how much they hate him. Okay, special. Lamont. I I don't know. Heal, heal Alex, sure. All right. And keep taking pictures of the dolls. Okay, pummel. This should really help. There we go. 16. Nice. Just knock them all out. Doll 18? Holy... And another 18. He just smited them. If you could just come into the battle doing that, that would help a lot. Ah, alright, now we got this damn body bag following us around. I don't know, I kind of want to finish exploring this room. And then maybe we'll, uh, take care of bobbers. Um, wait, we get a rest though, right? So... I'm going to do Psych. I may as well use up Lamont's MP here. Okay, one more. There we go. Alright. And then maybe next time we can rest or something. Uh, Alright, just zombies? Okay, that's no problem. I'm not at all worried. Alright, 20 XP. Jeez. Alec internalized their experience? What does that mean? Does he have a thousand points now or something? He can probably level up. I see some sort of blade link upon the shelf. Curved black sword. Back sword acquired. Okay. Is that what we have currently equipped? I can't even remember. So that would have been... Lamont has the... The sword. So... I don't know. Is that better? Use... Unusable by those gifted with magic. So he can't... Wait. Now nah, he can equip it? Um... I don't know, I guess we'll see if that improves. So, I mean, I looked at the stats earlier and I didn't notice anything, um, like anything changing with with the equipping. Like, I, I didn't notice any of the, whatever, like attack or fighting, I think fighting's the name of it, go up at all. So I don't know how else to gauge it other than just using it in combat, so. All right, I am getting out of here. I need to... Oh, great, an animus. And we don't have uh, bobbers with us. Can we even do damage? I think Lamont can. Let's let's see what we can do. So maybe... All right, you try attacking it. You use the flame. That should hurt him. And then we can get some pictures. But yeah, otherwise, I'm going to head out of the mansion, heal up bobbers, and then... I, I guess we can try going back in there. All right, what do we got for pictures here? Come on. Spider picture, 20 bucks. Nice, those are the dudes who jumped us. I'm glad we got good pictures of them. 300 for that thing? So it wasn't a boss? Like, like if I moved down that hallway, I just encountered it or something? That is a crazy enemy. Oh my, 300. Okay, 150, fair enough. 300. That was a lot of money. That I just made, what, 1050 off of that? Uh... Okay, dolls are 40 bucks. Good to know. So actually, the swords are better. Okay, 80 bucks. Oh my gosh. I am raking in the cash. Bobber's dying is no issue. And I would say overall, the quality of these pictures seem to be better. 
We only had a few duds. And a few fuzzies. Well, there's two fuzzies in the animus at the end, but... That is fine. Alright. I will be right back. We're gonna revive someone at the hospital and then probably sleep at the hotel. Oh, the curved back sword's actually worse than the thrusting sword. Alright, good to know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna switch those back real quick. Um, otherwise, I need to make sure... That we're topped up on film. I don't know. Buy some more of these. We, we have money now, so... I mean, I'm not, I'm not too worried. Yeah, just buy some of that. We got 2,830 still left over. I can't really spend it on much else, can I? Um, although we can go to the psychic medium. So, I think, yeah, Alec has enough, and I believe Morgan has enough. Yeah, yeah, she does. So. I would say with Alec, find clue, fast talk? I don't know what these are for. Fast talk is maybe for talking to people, like during the encounters. I don't know what find clue is. Do we have like perception checks in this game, like in Dungeons and Dragons or something or, or what? Anyways, um, he has a gun though, so probably up shooting. Granted, his special is like a pummel, so I bet fighting would help that, but anyways. Okay, so this just costs XP. And then for you, it's, so she has fighting and shooting skills, so I can probably equip weapons to her. I bet, but um, okay, she has two surgery. Uh, Bobbers has three surgery, so he should probably be the designated healing person. Um, I would say just up photography, and then that'll just... I mean, that'll return in dividends here. I could upgrade something else. What's what's everyone's fine clue ability, too? Should she be our investigator? Shouldn't the detective have fine clue? I don't... I don't know. Well, it makes sense for a journalist to be, uh, whatever, perceptive. I don't know why I'm trying to roleplay. I guess it's a roleplay game. <laughs> Okay, so uh, these guys need a little bit more before they can level up, so. Alright. Cool. So, you guys should be doing... Well, Alec at least should be doing more damage. That's nice. So, I think we're good to go then. Let's head back into the basement. And hopefully we don't run into another giant weird snake thing with worms in its mouth. Alright, let's try this little basement journey again. So, okay, right there was where I had the encounter. So, maybe it was a boss, or maybe it is just a random encounter. I don't know, the shelves lining this must be room are completely covered in spider webs. Yeah, alright, that's the description you had for the previous room. Well, alright, that looks like a problem. Okay, Wraith and Handstand. Of course they surprised us. Alex shivered, Bobber shivered, and more. All right, Lamont's the only, only guy with some guts around here. Handstand, Lamont took damage. Why do they always attack the person in the second position? Lamont got hit again. Is the second position the one that uh, gets hit the most? I don't know. I guess the positions are like slightly offset. Like Lamont and Morgan look like they're down more. I don't know if there's any significance to that, or if they just did that for readability reasons or something. I, I don't know. I got so much to learn about this game. Anyways, this guy looks ghostly, so I'm guessing our attacks aren't going to hurt him. Yeah, how does, how does cutting the wraith work? Okay, he dodged. It doesn't say he shrugged it off, though. Uh, quickly dodged. Okay, we're, just, we're still not confirmed. Okay, strange beam. There we go. Sh Ray shrugged it off. Okay, all right. So that means physical attacks don't do anything. Gotcha. Ray let out a whimper. Oh, great. Okay. Yep. Everyone's mind just goes to hell whenever anyone whimpers. All right. Well, at least they're dodging the handstands. And maybe we got a photograph. Lamont. I don't know. I'm going to put Alec in the second position because I don't know what the hell... I don't know how the order works, or maybe it doesn't. <laughs> maybe there's no mechanic there at all. Alright, so I guess you guys beat up the back line then. 
And I'll just be up to Bobbers to Strange Beam. Wait. Why do I have two Strange Beams? Did I... Did I change my... Dynamic Force Coil? Isn't that... Isn't that what I was supposed to have? Why do I, why don't I have magnetic beam here? Cuz I need the magnetic beam to do mental damage or whatever. So what if I do that? Will he equip that? Is that what happened? Did I get a new one recently? That is my bad. And actually I should have took another photograph of the wraith. I guarantee he's worth more than the handstands. Man, this battle is not going smoothly here. Seriously? Four points of damage to everyone? I might have to get the hell out of here. Okay, Morgan has her ability, though. Nothing happened. Oh, whoops. I thought that meant he would equip it. Are we just SOL, then? Um... Because if I can't equip it, I, can't, I don't have means of doing... Uh, like, physical damage. Or, excuse me, mental damage. And, uh, Lamont's fire attack doesn't do mental damage, it does physical, which I guess kind of makes sense on account of it being a fire, but... I don't know, I was thinking magic. Magic would work. Uh, let's just get out of here. We cannot flee. Alright, wonderful. Man, the basement sucks. <laughs> it really does. Oh my gosh, Lamont, please. Please hang in there, Lamont. We gotta try and run again. Uh, okay, Alec took four, that's fine. Okay, this is kind of a weird situation because Lamont has, or Alec has Pummel now. I don't know, it would make it safer to try and run if there wasn't all these enemies here. I'm kind of tempted to do that and I'll probably get some XP too. Lamont, you do your special. Um, I can use weak medicine. Wait, can I choose to use it on Lamont or does it heal the whole party? I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I'm a mess. I'm really learning. And Lamont's dead. Shit. I just got out of here to go revive people, and now Lamont's dead. This... <laughs> I knew the basement was gonna suck. Alright, can... Can Alec... Can you let loose with your punches already? Because we're taking heat. Damn, Alex gonna die pretty soon. Okay, Ray shrugged it off, that's fine. All right, just delete all these handstands. Maybe I should have tried to run. I don't, I don't know, 24? That's pretty good. And 20. Okay, at least we're not gonna take as much damage now. Now we should be able to get out of here. Bobberson used weak medicine, but nothing happened. How does that work? How do you, what, how am I supposed to use the medicine then? That, Okay, that, that's really weird. All right, let's get out of here. Unless there's a failure chance of the medicine. Or you can only use it out of combat. I don't know, let me just see. So you can choose, yeah, maybe you, huh. All right, maybe you can't use it in combat. All right, that's kind of weird. So, bobbers, why? Metam Psych Machine. We must have got a new one, and maybe I sold the old one. But that does suck if it can only do physical damage, so I can't fight ghosts at all. Oh, man. That really does suck. Alright, do I need to check every single shelf? Or is the whole, like... Whatever, shelf as a whole counted. Alright, well, that's, that's all we got down here. Um... Oh, yeah, we're definitely not dealing with that. Nope, getting out of there. We're getting out of the basement. I don't know, maybe I gotta go buy it at the old uh, science machine, because it's the only way I can deal with these guys. Oh, well, now we got surprised, so I don't think we have a choice. Yep, we're just right into combat. Man, this... This game is rough. Please, okay, alright, we were able to run away. Interesting. Okay, that was the second time I was able to rest. Like, on this trip. Can you rest every single fight? Ooh, spirit. Uh, I kind of want a picture of this thing. Granted, it looks like it's going to hurt, but... 
You know what, let me just try the second strange beam. Let me see if there's any difference there. Okay, photograph of the spirit, controlled strange beam, the second attack. That's, nope, that's still physical, but it can take physical damage, so I guess we're good. I, it's kind of weird. I fight, uh, yeah, the fighter spirit can take physical damage. I, I mean, that's fine. Easier for me to deal with. The spirit screamed? What kind of spirit is this? God. It, either they're screaming or they're whimpering. And to be quite honest, I think the whimper did more damage. Oh boy, that scream. That's really hurting us. Okay, Alec, you got pummel. I guess I guess you can use it. I think it has guaranteed hits, like. So may as well use it. Keep getting pictures of this thing. I don't know if this is another boss type enemy or something. It has quite a bit of health. 20 XP? Okay, well that's hardly anything. Alright, let's let's get out of here. Alright, well at least we cleared out like one little path in the basement for now. I guess we'll keep chipping away at it. I don't know. I mean, we get XP from some of the enemies. Well, that's not really true either. Like, by and large, I'd say the dan the the experience is about the same, but they're they're definitely tougher. I bet the hospital is loving me about this time. Oh, look, it's the dumbasses that keep dying and keep forking over three hundred dollars. Yep. All right. Yep. That's me. Ha ha. Funny. All right. Yep. Goodbye. Sorry that, like, whoever's in the second position is just gonna die. That is a non-preferable position. Speaking of which, um, let's change this around. Whoa. Uh, okay, no, I want you two to switch. And then, Alec, you go in the second position. Because you have the HP. And I'm, I don't know, I'm just gonna test my theory that the second position's who gets hit the most. Okay, all right. We're fully healed. Save. All right. We should be good now. Oh, wait. No, we have photos to uh, develop. Uh-huh. All right. Bad pictures. Very nice. Very nice. The Wraith. 120. That's pretty good. Uh, okay. All right. And the spirit is 80. Okay. So nothing, nothing too bonkers, but I don't know. We probably recoup the cost for having to revive Lamont, so that's, that's all right. So, it kind of looks like that I can't buy my science machine, my old one. Did I really sell it? I don't remember having done that, but it's, it's probably something I did. Yeah, there's nothing, nothing here. Well, dang, that is too bad. You know what? I am going to buy a compass, though. May as well do that. Now I'm living in a lamp of luxury. May as well buy some of these nice accessories. And I'll be able to see my position on the map, so that's pretty cool. Um, I think... Before he died, I think Lamont got enough to level up, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, so... And he's got the sword. Oh yeah, that's right. He has three shootings. I should have just gave him the gun. Um... Well, that's fine. Alright, I'll spend 500 doing that. What the hell is therapy? I don't know. Maybe mythos. Actually, yeah, let's level up mythos, too. Should be able to heal better now. And that just leaves... Uh, Bobbers. Okay, you need 20 more XP, so we'll, we'll deal with that later. Okay, so we're done with the door down there, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, I don't have a map of the area. A single girl's shoe lies on the ground. Is that what the find clue skill does? That'd be kind of interesting if it does. Door's locked. It is far too heavy for me to try and open it by force. And I only have the iron key, huh? Um... Well, let me just see here. Yeah, iron key, and that is about it. Dynamic force coil device. Wait, what? Sorry, did I try doing this earlier? No, okay, where... I could have swore I had that equipped before. Oh, machine. There. Oh, and you can attach different things to these? I must have switched this off at some point. 
Okay, now I have magnetic line. Okay, that's kind of cool. All right, I'm glad I figured that out. That was dumb. I don't know how that got unequipped. Maybe when I died? Maybe those unequipped? That must have been what happened, because I don't remember doing that myself. All right, so we can get in there through some stairs, it looks like, from the top floor, but otherwise, we're... I mean, we're fine. Did we even get anything good from this basement? I mean, we had to fight the boss down there. But then that was it. It was just kind of a dead end. So I guess, I don't know. I, maybe we'll have to go back at some point? That seems weird to me, though. I feel like we should have got some key item or something. All right, but we just have, uh, we got the sword. And like, um, yeah, we got the sword. The other room was empty, actually. And fought the boss, I guess, but anyways. Oh, look at that. All right, we can actually see where we're at now. Well, I know we do have another path by going straight up. Do I want to go upstairs? I don't know. Maybe, maybe just try going north from here. Alright, so we are up here. So I think if I go up in here... Have I searched this room? I don't think so. Oh, what is this? Oh, alright, just a singular ghoul. It's gonna take more than that. Maybe he's posing alongside the statue, I don't know. Alright, great. So it might just be my imagination, but I get the strangest feeling from this broken statue. Oh, boy. Okay, just an animus? Wait. Try and talk to it, maybe it's important. Looks like- oh. Okay, we just pissed it off. I, it seemed like a special ghost. Cold breath? Oh, my. Yup. Yup. Hammer everyone, go for it. Okay, let's do... I guess attack. Yeah, you guys attack. Well, there's not really a point, actually. You guys guard, and, and then we just need bobbers to do the magnetic line. Not another whimper. Oh, boy. Eight damage to Morgan? Jeez. Alright, please. Alright, there we go. Get that goes out of here. 20 XP. Gosh, that is... I don't know. Alright. Does this just keep spawning? Oh. I was thinking maybe something changed. Can I run away? Oh, cool. Alright, so, um... I don't know. Should I... Do I have more, like, holy water or something? Like, I don't know. I haven't gotten any hints about it. Benedict's memo, I... Why do I have that in my inventory? Do I need to show that at someone in town? I don't know. I don't know what that... What's up with that statue. Okay, where... Does this go? Oh, it's another path into the basement. Wait. No, it's not. This is another path upstairs. Uh, why? Okay. It's just a zombie. There's only a zombie up here. Is upstairs the same as the first floor? It actually could be. That would make my life a lot easier. And basement's only area with different enemies. Although there could be a floor above the second floor. This is a big mansion. Alright, it's not it's not out of the question. If they had a lot of money when they built this place. Two floors is for peasants. Alright. I really want to view a map to know how far I should go, but I'm pinned down by a mysterious force? What? So how do I go in there? A plant. A plant appeared. That's it? You know, no more description? Not like carnivorous plant? Like man-eating plant or something like that? I don't know. Should we talk to it? No good. Not talkers. Alright. I wasn't sure if the, you know plant had uh, vocal cords of some kind or whatever. So anyways, all right, we're gonna go back to the usual strategy of just beating the shit out of it. A couple stomps should take care of it, huh? Okay, I'm glad we got a picture though. It is remarkably dodgy for being a plant. For being rooted into the ground, it's really, it must be bobbing and weaving like crazy. We couldn't shoot it, we couldn't cut it. Hopefully the picture turned out. 
Ooh, spat out liquid. Okay, three. Oh, Alec is poisoned? Oh, that's an issue. I think I have one anti-poison item. 18 points of damage. That was really good. Okay, so we should probably... What if I rest? Does that get rid of poison? No. No, it does not. All right. Well, I probably want to do this right away here. Treats the effects of poisoning. There we go. All right. He's good again. Uh, so I can't... Was the plant the mysterious force? No, it wasn't. Okay. All right. Cool. Oh. Um. This. Talk to him? All right, so I guess don't talk to anyone unless there's a heads up on it. I, w I was thinking maybe the vampire could be reasoned with. This is a big issue, though, if there's vampires up here. Vampires slashed seven point. Yeah, I mean, vampires are pretty damn uh, powerful, typically, I think. I mean, I'm not the most educated on... Um, I don't know, the lore on vampires, but damn... Like, this is bad. Although he could bite us and give us immortality, so, you know. That's also... Maybe not the worst thing, health-wise. Alright, uh, okay. Can we hit this guy? He's really dodging. And of course he shows up with bats. That's pretty thematic. Okay, at least we got a photo of the vampire. Let's see, I don't think... What do vampires like? We got... I don't think we have any garlic in the back. I don't know. You know, actually, we have a Bible. We actually happen to have a Bible in my inventory. They probably wouldn't like that, actually. If I just open that up and start, like, just dropping verses, is that... Will that do some damage? Oh, he's dead. Okay, well... Actually, wasn't that crazy. Must have been a new vampire just born. That was... A little bit, little bit lackluster. I was expecting a big, big fight. Turns out a uh, possessed door is actually more formidable than a than a vampire. All right, survive 50 XP, not too bad, and bobbers can level up now, which is pretty nice. All right, so that that's interesting that there's that room up there, but it's just blocked off. So I don't know. We're gonna have to find some keys or. Something. Well, it's not even. I just said some force is pinning me. Oh, jeez. Okay. I was pressing the wrong button. I thought maybe I couldn't get through the door. I don't know what's up with the statue. I'm gonna wait till we get some more hints on that. Can I get out of here? Okay. I can. I can flee the weak enemies pretty easily, which is pretty nice. All right. We're. Wait. That doesn't. Does that go outside? Return to New Cam. Oh. I didn't realize there was a back entrance. That's kind of cool. That's kind of neat. I like that. All right. So, yeah, I've been recording for a little while now, and I'm actually just out of time. So I was, you know, I was hoping to get some big plot developments here, but I'm, I'm just kind of leaving us with a mystery with this episode here. I don't know. I mean, at least we picked up the body. We did investigate what's, what's through that staircase, but... Uh, well, we kind of hit a dead end down there. That was, you know, that staircase behind the bookshelf in the basement. So, whatever. I guess when we come back, we'll just have to explore more of the mansion. Hopefully get more hints. I don't know. Maybe I should drop by the fortune teller. She'd probably help me out. I don't know. She was kind of spot on last time. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next one.